Hey guys, Kimmy here, and today I'm going to be doing a makeup tutorial, an emo makeup tutorial. Let's get dark. By the way, I'm wearing a Kylo Ren shirt today. It's awesome. Kylo Ren equals Bay AF. So, um, yep. First thing I'm going to put on is some foundation. I'm so sorry about the previous lighting. Um, I don't know if I really necessarily liked that lighting. Um, yeah. First things first, I am not sponsored, but Coffee Bean, it's so good. It's just this, this is my life. This is my everything. Um, that's all I need. You know, guys, I don't really need food. I don't really need, you know, friends. I just have my coffee bean, got some Netflix going. I'm all good. By the way, happy freaking Valentine's Day today, guys. It is Valentine's Day. I don't know if it will be when I post this video, but you know, you guys all deserve some love. So plenty of love coming from here. Um, yeah, so happy Valentine's Day, guys. Well, the first thing you're gonna wanna do, I use this foundation, um, Milani. It works really well. Um, it might be slightly a little bit dark on my skin, like just a teeny bit, but um, that's really because I need to get a tan. I'm a little bit light right now, but I need some more sun and some more vitamin D. <laughs> yeah, it's important that if you wanna cover your face, to make it, um, to make your face have a little more coverage. It is, um, completely by all means necessary if you would choose it to be necessary. So, you know, just go ahead and, um, blend it. You want to get every little area and do your neck a little bit too, because you don't want it uneven, really. It just looks kind of weird, kind of funky a little bit. I don't know how crazy I am about this lighting, but I decided, you know what guys, I definitely need to just make more videos and not complain and be so picky because I kind of get like into perfection mode where I want all my videos to be perfect. I want to say the perfect thing. I want to make the perfect lighting, the perfect video, the perfect script, the perfect editing. Yeah, I'm just starting off. There's no way I can do that. Um, perfect doesn't exist. There's no perfect anything really, besides coffee of course. <laughs> um, yeah, so. Really guys, um, if you want to make YouTube videos, just freaking do it. Just make YouTube videos. That's what I'm doing. I'm just making my video and I don't care if this is just the cringiest, you know, makeup tutorial of your life. Like, I'm making a video and that's all I really need. I might be putting way too much, um, foundation on. And you might not even see that part of my skin, but whatever. So, yeah guys, just honestly, if you want to do something, and that goes with anything, not just for YouTube, but if you want to do something, just do it. It's gonna be worth it, and if it makes you happy, then by all means, make yourself happy and do it, because life's too short. Just be happy. Just be happy. The second thing we'll do, and this is, you don't have to do this, but I don't have an eye primer, so I use chapstick. It's kind of ripped a little, but um, yeah, so chapstick works. Um, it makes the makeup stay on pretty decently. Um, yeah, just, you know, if you just put on eye, eyeshadow or eyeliner and it's, um, doesn't have some kind of, like, little sticky substance on it, um, it's not gonna stay that well, it could fall off, so, this is the cheapest primer you'll ever use. I don't have anything else other than this, so. And that's the look, do you guys like it? Oh, what is that? Oh, <gasps> what the heck? What the heck? Okay, guys, something happened to me. I'm just now seeing this. Like, no joke, I didn't see this until now, and there's cuts or something or veins on my eyes or a bruise. Did someone beat me up and I didn't even know? Do I have it on this eye? Whoa. Whoa. I... Okay, I'm trying not to freak out right now because I'm a really big hypochondriac. But I have a cut or something on my eye, and I didn't see it until now. Um, I'll be right back. I'm gonna ask my mom what this is. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay, guys, I'm back. So I'm not dying. Turns out I'm not dying. Um, it looks a lot worse on the camera for whatever reason than it does in real life. I'm not dying. I hope not. Hey, if I do, you get to see it on video. Cool. First thing you want to do, and uh, like I was saying, every scene emo kid knows this very well. Your staple piece is your eyeliner. This is your weapon of choice. You're gonna wanna do a, um, a wing 
Um, I'm probably gonna end up um, doing a lot of eyeshadow, but you want to go slow. Do it thin at first because you can always make it thicker. The important part that you is that you get it right. So I usually do that. This is usually how I do my wings um, nowadays all the time, like every day. I don't wear makeup every single day, but when I do wear makeup, I usually do like a wing like this. And sometimes um, I won't do at bottom eyeliner, but I'll do like, I'll make like the edge a little bit like, put a little eyeliner on the edge because I think it makes my eyes pop. I think it's really cute and I like it like that. I used to hate putting on eyeliner. It was such a pain, but now I mastered it. So we're going to do the bottom. The eyeliner I'm currently using is L'Oreal Paris uh, Voluminous Superstar. It's just a kind of like pin. It's like, it feels like a Sharpie pin eyeliner. And these are my favorite eyeliners personally because um, I think you can really get in there. You can do a good job. And I don't like full on liquid eyeliner because it's a little bit messy and um, I just like the way this turns out a little bit more. Ooh, already looking more emo. <laughs> Yeah, this looks good so far. And the second thing you guys are gonna wanna do is, uh, the, okay, this eyeliner, I kid you not, it's a really good eyeliner. It's a uh, Sonia Kashuk, I don't know if I said that right, um, Black Onyx Long Wear Eye Definer. It's just a pencil. I normally don't like pencils that much. I usually just use the pen like I just showed you. But if you wanna do um, your waterline, I highly recommend you get like, either one from Sephora or a Sonia, like, I think this was from Target, I don't really know. I got it for Christmas. But this one, really good eyeliner. Excellent. So if you want to do your waterline, which is the inside of your eye, um, this one sti sticks on really fast and it stays on. So we'll get in there and uh, this one gets the job done. Um, okay. <laughs> Well, so long as you um, sharpen it the right way and all that. So, we are going to sharpen it a little bit more. And I usually, for some reason, every time I've ever used a eyeliner pencil, I've never been able to, or actually come to think of it, a, um, a liquid pen or any other kind of eyeliner, I've never been able to use my waterline. I always thought it was because it's like, maybe I have a very sensitive waterline. But uh, it turns out this one is just, it, it's a really good quality, I guess. So that is why it at least works with my waterline. But now it's not, as I show you guys, it's not working with my waterline. Okay. <laughs> All of a sudden it's gonna be dumb and it's trying not to work. So we're gonna have to go again with our sharpener. Take a sharpener. Take your sharpener, I don't know what I'm doing. Um, yep. <laughs> so take your sharpener, guys. Sharpen this. Very sharp. Remember guys, for an emo scene makeup tutorial, you gotta want thick eyeliner because it makes your eyes pop. It's cute. You can go in there a little bit and um, from the faded pen, just go over it a little with your pencil. This is like the thick look. I'm gonna close this eye a little. I'm gonna have to fix it a little, but um, yeah, so I usually do that and I've done this. So that's what it looks like so far. I think it looks cute. I like it, it looks good. Um, it's pretty thick, but um, of course we can make it thicker, so that's what we're gonna do. So second step. I might be doing things out of order than you guys, how you guys do your makeup, so forgive me if I do things kind of weird. I just do things weird in general, so that's just me. Anyways, take some black eyeshadow. This is just e.l.f. brand. Just gonna take a big chunk and um, see how easy that goes on, guys, because you put the chapstick on or the primer. It goes on so much easier, so I kind of go in there from the wing. I have to touch it up a little bit because it's a little bit messy. How I do it. May not be the best, but um, hey, from far away, it looks pretty good. <laughs> it 
it looks good from far away. So as you can see, before and after. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the other eye. Well, actually, I should put mascara on. Yeah. I need to fix this up a little. It's a little bit messy, but I'm gonna fix it up. I'm gonna do the other eye, and then I'll show you guys the results. It's cute, though. I think it makes your eyes pop. Ta-da! Um, doesn't, definitely doesn't look the best. I'm aware of that. Um, rip my makeup, my emo makeup skills. They died along with my heart. <laughs> yeah, anyways. This is, um, I guess it's a look. I definitely need to, like, make adjustments if I was gonna go out like this. Doesn't look that bad from far away. You get a little closer, you're like, okay. Oh, doesn't look that bad. Anyways. Yep. This is how I did it. Um, it looks good. Obviously, I'm not the most professional makeup artist in the world. That's not my occupation. Could always improve. I got some emo-y stuffed animals. You can't get more emo than that. Actually, can you get more emo than this? I'm pretty sure you can. To answer your question, you can get more emo than that. So... That's the look. Um, hope you guys like it. I'm sorry it wasn't the best. That's basically it. I don't know what else to say, really. Maybe throw on a beanie. That might make the look a little bit cuter. There's a beanie now. Whoa, how'd that happen? Magic beanie! That's really lame. My jokes will get better in time, guys. So, that might make the look a little bit cuter. Um, usually I will put bobby pins on it. If you guys like my video, make sure you leave a like, make sure you comment, subscribe, that would mean a lot to me. I'm gonna make some more videos, and I really will, I really, really, really will. I made a realization the other day that, like I said before, it doesn't matter how many views you start off with, because even the most top YouTubers, they didn't start with anything at first, you know? No one can start from, you know, the very top of the ladder on YouTube. And I'm not even looking to be at the top of the ladder, but I'm just saying it's easy to get discouraged because you may not have a lot of subscribers or a lot of viewers, but make videos for fun. Do it because you like doing it. And I like to make people's day, so I'm really just, I'm looking forward to making other people smile and enjoy my content. And I love meeting new people, so if you guys wanna talk to me, you can follow me on Instagram. I will link it down in my description box. And yeah, enjoy my content. If you guys have any video recommendations, definitely let me know. And I would love to make some more videos that you guys would want to see on my channel. So bye guys.